As most of you know, I'd rather face Warren Spahn than make a speech. <laughs> so I beg your indulgence. I've been coming to this historical place for many years. When I was a member of the New York Giants and when I was a member of the Chicago Cubs, I played in the ceremonial games. Only last year, I was sitting out there in the audience, and now, up here, among those to be honored, is the tribute to baseball, and it gives me a feeling that cannot be described. I never saw some of the old timers, but I read about Long George Kelly, one of the most versatile players to ever put on a uniform. Of course, Warren Spahn, who was the toughest left-hander that I ever faced. And of course, my real good friend, Roberto Clemente, for hitting, for, pit, for hitting, for feeling, for throwing, for hitting with power, for hitting for high average to one of the greatest that ever did it. I met Roberto many years back in Puerto Rico, and we became real close friends. Vera Clemente, immediately behind so Monty Irvin. With these men, and all of the rest of the Hall of Famers, gives me a feeling that I cannot describe. The only thing I can say is just the greatest in the world. You know, I played in the bus leagues for many years. Overworked, underpaid, but somehow now this does not seem to be in vain. And I hope my induction will help to ease the pain of all those players who never got a chance to play in the majors. I wish my father could be here today because he was a great baseball fan. He passed away a few years ago. But when I was growing up, he was always there to give me a word of encouragement. And Warren Spahn with Vera Clemente. He would have certainly enjoyed being here and sharing this honor with me. Finally, I received many thrills in baseball. I remember the 1951 miracle year of the New York Giants. I remember all the honors that I received in Puerto Rico, Mexico, Venezuela, and Cuba. Stan Musial. But none can equal the great feeling. Casey Stengel. Wow, wonderful, marvelous feeling that I have right now. It's the greatest I've ever had. Thank you. Monty Urban, the newest inductee into the Hall of Fame in Cooperstown.